Starting the day off right in the car wash. I washed this the other day and left it parked underneath uh, red maple trees or Norwegian maple trees. They flowered yesterday <laughs> and it rained. So the flowers are all over the boat. My plan was always to bring it to the car wash and give it a coat of wax. So I'm going to do that now. I'm also going to clean the mats of the car first as well. Clean sailboat. The car is clean too. That's what that green X stuff does. Makes the water beat up in the windows. So I've given the boat and the car a coat of wax. Clean my mats. Giving them a coat of wax as well. These will go all out, right? Let's go load the boat you two and finally hit the road. That's what's sailing. Just doing one last circle check. Checking my lights. Flashy, flashy. Breaky, breaky. Got the boat loaded. Got the car loaded. Everything's tied down and tight. Lights on this side, lights on this side. Got my towing mirrors on. Not so happy with the passenger side one, but just uh, doesn't adjust properly. Uh, I'm leaving a little bit later than I wanted to, but c'est la vie. It's 12.30. I wanted to leave about 11, 11.30. That's just takes that time to get everything together, right? Don't want to forget something. And I haven't forgot anything yet. I've decided not to bring things, that's what I'm saying. Just stopped in uh, Walkerton, Ontario, to uh, grab something to eat. Stop, I forget the name of the place. Old Joe's or something. <coughs> uh, Pub grub. I had a burger and fries. Now I just grab a coffee at Tim's and I'm heading out. I've got about another 40 minutes to get to Wyerton. Welcome to Wyerton. This is the public access, uh, water access ramp. And <laughs> there's a couple of my buddies. Three, four, wow. That's, uh, Go see what they're up to. Okay, it's what time is it? It's a uh, quarter to five. So, uh I took my time getting here, as you can tell by the time. I was stopping for leisurely lunch, and I stopped at the grocery store, got another coffee, and got a bag of wood, and uh, some nuts and twigs to eat. I'm gonna put the boat in the water, so I'm gonna rig it. I'm just gonna back up to where everybody else is there. We'll get this thing rigged up. Okay. Gotta get a toucan. It's cold and windy out there. Glad I brought my winter coat. I've got the siren set up, mask is up, booms on, I'm going to put it in the water. I also put the drain plugs in, did that before I left home. Can you grab one of those lines, Peter?
The bumpers are on the other side. When the boat's off the trailer here, it's a good time to take a look at the trailer and see how it's doing. Make sure that uh, things aren't falling apart. Boat's in. This is Arx cat boat. These are the Can-Am guys. Some of them, anyway. Swired in Cold Boys Bay. That's uh, White Cloud Island. Another island back there, I can't remember the name of it. Don't worry, Ark, if it does fall off, I'll put it on YouTube for you. <laughs> okay, you stop there and we can unhook it. Bubbles coming out of the bearing? Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is uh, Dockside Willie's. Just had supper there. This is where Willie lives. He, uh, his house. I'm just gonna get my picture taken with him over here. Well, there's uh, some of the fleet. My boat and our ex boat are in the water. Just gonna go down here and get my picture taken with one of these willies. There's a whole bunch of willies around the town. There's one with a tie, or maybe that's a scarf. That one's got a bow tie. And this is the, <laughs> the naked one. This is the spitting willy. Water spits out of his face here. I'm going over to the campsite uh, spot where we're, uh, where we're anchored, <laughs> we're docked, I guess. Uh, we can't have campfires. So we're gonna have campfire over in the campground where we're allowed to. To go on the street <laughs> to get to the campground. So we've got some guys like myself staying in the boats uh, docked for the night and a couple other guys are staying in their boat on shore so they're going to be in the campground. We've got permission to be in the campground. Uh, but we don't have permission to be by the dock in the boat or on shore. It's fine to be in the water, but not on shore. It's kind of kind of funny that way, but it keeps uh, keeps the riffraff from uh, setting up camp at the the dock. Oh, hey, Todd's here. Perfect. Another guy. This is the campground, and I bring the tent and I just stay down here. It's nice, right on the lake. Made a fire. Just lit it, actually. Guys over here have a little fire going. Todd has a stove in his boat that he's uh, built. And I just lit that. I just lit this. I get it going. This is getting cold. We're in a winter coat, a toque, mittens. Oh, good, my fire's crackling. So. Here I am, I'm in the siren. I've got to make my bed. Uh, it's still all rolled up. So, uh, just been trying to get my <laughs> my phone to charge, but it won't charge. Oh, not since Jasmine couldn't come. Look who's here, it's Stan. Stan the sock monkey. 
glad he's here with me. One of the things I picked up, Brian made these uh, stickers, uh, decals. So I'm gonna selectively stick those on things. Well, thanks for watching. Click the clicky things, and uh, I'll uh, let you know how the night goes. It's, uh, well, there's frost warnings tonight. So it's going down to about one or two degrees. Oh well, I'm ready for it. Thanks.